I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Hey, Brahmins, welcome back to another glorious Monday. I want to give a shout out to all who came out to support at the Powder Puff game last Friday. Wow. That was some entertainment for sure. Seniors won the football game 52 to 22, but the juniors won the cheer competition and the seniors took home the halftime show. So congratulations to all who participated. It turned out to be quite a successful fundraising event. So thank you all for coming out and supporting them. I um, also want to give a shout out to our winter guard. They came in third place at the S. Oh, hold on. Here we go. South Florida Winter Guard Association Championship um, over the weekend. Third place at the championship. That is amazing. Congratulations to you all. If you have not had a chance to see their show, they are going to be performing um, in a few weeks on April 26th. That's a Friday night at 6 p.m. Don't forget that this is the opening week for Greece. The musical, our drama club will be putting that on beginning this Friday. We will have shows this Friday, this Saturday, and next Friday and next Saturday. Tickets are $12. You can get your ticket on hometownticketing.com. I also want to do a shout out for those who participated in the State Science Fair last week. Clea Judea received a special award from the Hernando Science and Engineering Fair. Ashton Ponzo got a special recognition award for his project in behavioral science, and he earned sixth place. Jackson Holcomb earned fourth place in earth space and environmental sciences, and Brady Williamson came away with third place in plant sciences. So congratulations to all of you. All right, on both campuses, you may have heard of a little event happening this afternoon, beginning around 145. Um, our area in Florida will be experiencing a partial solar eclipse. Now, there are some safety precautions. You don't ever want to look directly at the sun. This is something that you've learned since you were a little kid, and it's no different today. Looking directly at the sun can cause permanent damage to your retina, so please be smart and not do that. You have to have specialized glasses, not just sunglasses, not even polarized sunglasses are going to protect your retina from um, the sun. So just use common sense and do not look directly at the sun this afternoon. Um, in the parent newsletter, there is a link to some other safety precautions if you want to get in there and dig a little deeper. That's all I have for now. All right. I don't have much. We have a baseball game and a softball game here at home campus. Um, baseball is playing Lake Placid. Softball is playing Vera Beach. Both of those games start right at seven o'clock. So make sure that you have your tickets in hand or on your phone ticket. Hometown ticketing. Sorry. Hometown ticketing. Um, get your tickets there. Have your IDs. All of the good things. Have a great day. Um, and freshmen, make sure you turn in your scheduling forms from Mrs. Tatters. Um, that deadline is approaching quickly. That way she has your schedule and to put it in for next year. If not, remember, she will choose your classes. All right. That's all we have for this Monday. Make it a good one. As together, we move, move forward. Oh, sorry. I never know when there's three of us. So. Move forward. Be great. And be wrong. <laughs> all, all day. day.